This brief video will attempt to answer the question, what is Column Manager for HBase, and how does it work? You probably suspect that it has something to do with managing column structures in HBase? Correct. But this question implies a more fundamental question. What is HBase? If you feel that you already have a pretty good answer to that question, then you're in the right place, and we are ready. Let's go. As one who's familiar with HBase, you realize that while they contain structures referred to by the familiar names tables, rows, columns, these structures work rather differently than they do in a traditional relational database, especially columns. This freewheeling nature of HBase columns can be a very good thing, but it also gives the possibility for a certain amount of disorder, even potentially chaos to evolve through the life of an enterprise application. Particularly in your development and testing environments, you might want a bit more explicit knowledge and direct control of your columns. Here's where Column Manager for HBase can step in. You might want to take advantage of column auditing to simply keep track of the column qualifiers that your application is generating. Or, for an already existing table, you can run Column Discovery, probably using its MapReduce option, to track down and report on all column qualifiers in a family. And Column Manager introduces Column Definitions to give you a couple of options. The most passive option lets you set up column definitions that you think represent all the columns in a given family, and then generate a report which identifies discrepancies with those definitions, if any are found. If you prefer a more active approach... Column Definition Enforcement can be enabled for a column family. When enforcement is enabled, any attempt by an application to store an undefined or invalid column will result in a Column Manager I.O. exception being thrown. This will sound familiar to those experienced with coding against traditional relational databases. Column Aliasing borrows a technique employed in some legacy mainframe databases to conserve storage space by substituting short column aliases in tables in place of full-length qualifiers. When enabled for a column family, the aliasing facility works invisibly to the developer, who continues to code applications using normal qualifiers, while column manager works in the background swapping qualifiers and aliases appropriately during all put and get operations. Lastly, there are also facilities for exporting and importing complete schemas out of and into HBase, something that could prove very useful, even if you use none of Column Manager's other features. That's our quick overview of Column Manager for HBase please go to any of these links for much more information and to try it out for yourself. Thanks for watching.